So I have received some new information from Prodigy themselves on the removal of Crystal Caverns, why they did it, and what this could mean for the future. So I'm going to go over all of that in this video. I hope this brings some much needed clarity on the sudden removal of Crystal Caverns. So if you don't know, May 14th brought the removal of one of Prodigy's most interesting areas in the game, it just got taken away. They gave us uh, a notice in Wizard Watch, but honestly, we still had no idea why Crystal Caverns was removed up until now. So I'm going to share this information in this video. So let's go ahead and get into it. When I asked Prodigy about the unexpected removal of the fan favorite area, here's the response I got. Regarding Crystal Caverns, we are looking into the evolution of this area as we develop more live ops in our games and create different refreshed events. So Prodigy removed Crystal Caverns because they are looking into expanding the area further? What does this mean? Honestly, what this sounds like to me is that we could be looking at a new and improved version of Crystal Caverns being added in the future. Because this response clearly indicates that Crystal Caverns is not fully gone forever. At least, not the idea of it. It is unknown if Crystal Caverns itself will return, but the idea of Crystal Caverns and the type of area exploring it introduced because crystal caverns obviously introduced a very interesting type of gameplay for prodigy the camera would literally follow you as you walked around and played the adventure of crystal caverns the boss battles were great the prizes were great the snups were great and that was the place you could rescue Shiver Tusk for the longest time. Crystal Caverns was very unique, and we need something like that in Prodigy. So it's good to hear that when they removed it, the idea of Crystal Caverns is not gone. They are working on basically expanding and developing the area further. Now, think about this. Wouldn't it be cool if Prodigy added a Crystal Caverns type area for all five of the elemental areas? That would be awesome. I've hoped that could be a possibility someday for like years, but honestly I knew it was likely never going to happen. That would be a ton of work and it would, even if it could happen, it would take years and years and years for it all to get out. And I'm not saying that's what we would be getting with this update. I just think that sometime in the future, like year or a couple of years, I don't know how long it would take to uh, redevelop the area, expand it. it. Something could just come out that is kind of like Crystal Caverns, but a different type of area, maybe in a different elemental area because think about it, when they said they want to create more different refreshed events, they're saying that Crystal Caverns was kind of getting a little bit old because it, it's been in the game since 2020. It was in the game for five years before it was removed. So what I think they mean is that they want to make this type of area in a different elemental area. And that sounds like a good idea to me. I would love to see the uh, Crystal Caverns uh, adventure in differently, played differently in a different elemental area like Firefly Forest or Bonfire Spire, Shipwreck Shore or Skywatch. All of those would be awesome to have a Crystal Caverns type area in the game. And that would be great. I. Like, that's like the best case scenario, in my opinion, unless we just have both Crystal Caverns and that area. But, um, for what is 
most likely for Prodigy to do. I think that's the best case scenario. So that is what I am taking from this. I believe that Prodigy is going to be working on a different type of crystal caverns for a different area so that uh, it can all feel new and refreshed and we're not playing the same old thing over and over again for a ton of years. So yes, that's my take on it. It is really good to know that Prodigy did not remove crystal caverns and the idea of it for like ever. Crystal Caverns may be gone forever, but the idea of it lives on and is seeming to be recreated, and that is in the works in Prodigy right now. Who knows when that could come out, but, like, it's good to know that they are planning these things ahead and starting to work on them so that things can feel more refreshed and we can have new things to do in Prodigy. So, what are your thoughts on all of this? What are your thoughts on the removal of Crystal Caverns, and what would you like to see from a replacement to Crystal Caverns in the future? Let me know all of your thoughts in the comments.